Meanwhile, President Mohamed Buhari has sent a letter to the Senate seeking an approval to take a loan to the tune of $800 million from the World Bank to cushion the effect of subsidy removal. This follows the federal government's April announcement of an uh, $800 million World Bank grant targeting 50 million vulnerable Nigerians or 10 million households as part of a subsidy palliative measures. The Minister of Finance, Budget and National Planning, Zainab Ahmed, highlighted that the engagements are ongoing with the newly established Presidential Transition Council, PTC, and the incoming administration to drive the palliative program, which includes the need for bosses amongst various considerations. In a letter read by the President of the Senate, Senator Ahmed Lawan, President Buhari, who noted that the loan would be utilized to scale up the National Social Safety Net Program, said the loan would be sourced from the World Bank. Approved an additional loan facility to the tune of USD 800 million to be skewered from the World Bank for the National Social Safety Net Program and the need to request for your consideration and approval to ensure early implementation, copy of fake extract attached. The Senate may wish to know that the program is, is, is intended to expand coverage of shock, responsive, safety net support among the poor and vulnerable Nigerians. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.